Hey, this is a PSA for all you Anycubic Viper and Cobra Max owners. Uh, the Cobra Max and the Anycubic Viper use the exact same uh, volcano nozzle. Uh, assembly everything, even the string gauge is the same. So uh, one of the biggest problems that I've seen, because I, I try to go onto the forums and see, hey, what problems are people are having? I'm, I don't really have that many problems. After seven years of running uh, Creality machines and dealing with all of their crap, uh, a Viper is a cakewalk. It is so much easier to use. You apply the heat, because it's an all metal now, because it's a bimetal uh, assembly, this is the upgrade so that the PTF tube does not go up right against the print nozzle. I reinsert the heater core, reinsert the thermistor. The most important thing to remember about these Vipers and the Cobra Maxes, do not tighten or loosen or adjust that nozzle when it's in the string gauge. That is the fastest way to damage that string gauge and when you damage that string gauge, it's meant to go up and down. It's meant to read that up and down movement and not left to right. It is not meant to deal with the torque of pulling off a nozzle, especially a volcano nozzle. So I always pull my assemblies. I buy up a couple of these nozzles so that I have multiples ready to go. So if I have a problem with the nozzle, I can just swap it out. It's got the little board. You plug it back in. Super easy.